Hello everyone. We're really looking forward to welcoming you back starting from Monday on your allotted days. You should by now have received information through the post about how things are going to be done every day, how things are going to look and our expectations. And in this video we'll be just giving you a little bit of an insight into what school looks like. School will look very, very different to what you're used to. It's really important, however, that you stick to our rules and our regulations and our expectations during this time to keep you, your families and our staff safe. What is really important before you even think about coming into school is to ensure that none of you, staff included, show any symptoms of COVID-19. If you experience any of these symptoms, please let us know and contact Public Health Wales to ensure that the track and trace is in operation. Just as a reminder, if you have a new or continuous cough, if you have lost a sense of taste and a sense of smell, and if you have a high continuous temperature, please seek medical advice and do not come into school. Good morning. Uh, this is our start and welcome back video. Uh, for the owners who are coming into school, you come in from the car park at the top of phase two, come down the steps, be greeted by myself or another member of SLT. We'll make sure that you are booked in in attendance in the school, that's important, just in case you have any fire drills, and uh, to make sure that we can comply with all safety regulations. You'll have the opportunity to wash your hands here you, using hand sanitizers, but also you'll be allowed to, to wash your hands in the toilets. No learners are, past, are allowed to go past this point into the offices for safe environments. When I've booked you into the school, I will direct you via the 3G stairs to your classroom. Your classrooms will look very different. As you can see, all the desks are two metres apart. Once you arrive, you will need to remain at your desk. This is the same for staff and pupils. You will also need to bring your own equipment. This should include pens, pencils, ruler, and rubber. The break times and lunch times will also be taken at your desk. You will need to bring your own lunch. This should include food as well as a bottle of water. You will need to take all your rubbish home with you. It is very important that you do not share these with anyone else. Should you need to use the toilet, please inform your teacher and your teacher will directly direct you to the designated toilet. There will also be a sanitising station within the room. Should you sneeze, cough or blow your nose, please use a tissue. This will then be disposed of in the allocated bin. This is following the guidelines of Health Wales. You need to catch it, bin it, kill it. This is phase three and it's where you will find the learning support department. In phase three, you can see the school nurse, the school counsellor and visit our learning support staff. We are here to support you with your basic skills and your emotional well-being. I hope that's given you a little bit of a flavour of what you will expect to see when you come into school. Part of the success of these catch-up, check-in and prepare days is your maturity. Our power policy is still in force and our expectations are incredibly high to ensure that you're safe when you are in school. Warnings will be given if social distancing measures are not adhered to and we will be very, very strict in enforcing this. If persistent misbehaviour happens, we will be ringing parents to collect children in order to keep the rest of the class safe. We are relying on you, our Bishop Headley family, to ensure that we keep one another safe, to ensure that this is a success, to enable you to be prepared to come back in September. Stay safe everyone, and we look forward to seeing you soon. Bye.